So we're out in the uh, car parking area now. So we've done inside the actual show where we're parked and now we're out here with the uh, pre-90s and it looks like a selection of supercars or similar. But I'm going to take a beeline away from those to... Oh, that's lovely, that Aston McLaren. Oh, yeah, we like that. I wonder if he's going to start it off and drive off. He is. Ah, uh, Mr Bond, they have been expecting you. They're lovely. That's a proper car. Of course, Mr. Bond had a DB5, did he not? Not DB6. <laughs> so it's quite a nice array of things. We got a Rover. We've got another. Ah, I recognise a car over here. That be the car of Chris Mountford. So where is he today? Because I've not seen him. I know you're here. Hi Chris, wherever you are. Nice to see your car here, mate. I'm taking it, he turned up late. He's in good company, look at that next to him. Or is it that the Citroen's in good company? What do you think? Wow. The 205 there. Is I think a Roland Garros one. It is. You can tell by the colour. It's unusual. That's BMW. What have we got at the back here? We've got a Porsche there. A couple of Porsches. Nice MX5. This is nice. So we're just going to do a random walk round here. Um, like the BMW convertible at the back of it. It's a 2002, isn't it? I think. Sierra Cosy. Lovely Corvette. That's pretty cool too, isn't it? I've seen that here before, I think. I'm Dolomite. <laughs> Lovely little car. <coughs> Loads of Triumph Stags at the front, Porsche driving along there, we'll follow that along. Lovely Alpha. Uh, 
Rally uh, Mitsubishi Evo. Gosh, real mix in here, isn't it? Oh, we have got an early Golf GTI, I think. That should be inside, seeing it's hot hatch day. That's lovely, that. Get a couple of that for me. Thanks. Needs a bit on the paint, but very, very original. Lovely car. Gold skyline. Next to an Esprit. Surrounded by Porsches. A spot. What can I spot over there? Got a Metro, MG Metro. That looks in good condition. Where else would you find yourself? More like the old uh, BMW An MG Metro Not a turbo, just the MG Metro Oh and it's for sale too With the old Moss stickers on the side of it Remember the Moss alarm? Absolutely useless So uh, is that a 7 at the beginning of that? It is 12.7 OT One lady owner haven't they all? 89.22 Wow 54,000 miles Nick, park next to an Austin Allegro or Lawl Agro or whatever you want to call it well, I like that. Picture of this Renault for me, Sam, please. And then of the white Capri behind. That's lovely, isn't it? That's fantastic. Lovely old Renault. Ford Capri with a wide body kit on it. German plate, left hand drive, oh, rats. <laughs> Take one of that. Another one nine GTI Peugeot. And the reason I'm turning off here is to have a look at the Citroen CX. It's a diesel turbo too. 
right alloys quite unusual with the skirt along the bottom it's got the leather, leather interior quite similar to that of the SM of the time of uh, the 70s if you remember the 70s SM has a very similar interior to that I always think they look the same if you look at the one that I don't know if I've taken pictures of the one we've got but look at uh, the leather interior on that and compare it to the SM and CX and I always think they look quite similar this is lovely condition that <laughs> that golf. It's still a massive engine. <laughs> Lovely. Well, is there more or is that it? I think that is it for the pre 90s car park. It looks like they've stuck stuff a bit everywhere today. So I think we're going to finish off with. The Audi and the Jack. <laughs>